this up. You wanted some more Ask Cameron, so here you go. At what2830 from Twitter asks, if you could have any superpower, what would it be? If I could have a superpower, it would be telekinesis just because I think it'd be really cool to control people with my mind. Sometimes the cats don't love me, so I would want to control them to come to me and snuggle with me and control my mom to go in a different room or <laughs> something. I don't know. <laughs> but, yeah. Or, or cook me dinner. <laughs> but she already does that, so. <laughs> Guy, Michael Slack from Facebook asked, what is the funniest onset story you have from Gotham? The funniest onset story would have to be we're filming episode 10 and the director, we were like in a garden or whatever, and the director said uh, action and the moment he said action, a bee started flying around David, and David was trying to dodge it, and he couldn't get away from it. So I was, it was really hard not to laugh. But so yeah, it doesn't really sound funny, but you had to be there. Right. Holding at Selena Hard from Facebook asked, "What are the top three happiest moments in your life?" The top three happiest moments would be getting Mr. G for Christmas being elite protege for the 2011-2012 tour for the Pulse on tour Selena Kyle on Gotham <laughs> my first <laughs> I have to blow my nose <laughs> at power underscore Ronger from Twitter asks cats or pizza um I don't eat cats so I would choose pizza I like pepperoni pizza at Dirty Pig with two Y's and two G's uh, from Twitter asks, would you ever go skydiving? Yeah, I would love to go skydiving. I and mean, I have been trying to let my dad take us, but he's... Lara Hutley with two T's from Facebook uh, asks, how does it feel to have a parent in the military? I feel proud to have a parent in the military. My dad's been in the military my whole life, so I'm, I'm pretty used to it. I mean, when he's, when he's gone, it gives me a reason to do well and to keep busy and do what I need to do. It's hard sometimes because I can't see him or something like that, but FaceTime has made it very easy. And um, when, when I was little, I would have like a laminated picture of my dad in my toy box so that I wouldn't ever, you know, miss him. I miss him anyway, but it would made it easier. Shout out to all the military people out there. Okay. At RB underscore RBN from Twitter asks, if you had to describe yourself in only one word, what would it be? Fantasmasnical. No, no. <laughs> oh, by the way, that's fantastic, magical, and some other word mixed together. I don't even know what the other word is. But I would say, I'm just going to say fantasmasnical. No, I'm not going to say fantastical. Indecisive. <laughs> Can't decide on anything, really. Where, what food to eat, what shoe to wear. At JJStV003 from Twitter asked, What was the hardest thing you had to do while shooting Gotham? The hardest thing to do while shooting Gotham? So far, it's been the pilot having to shoot in the, you know, negative 15 degree weather. <laughs> that was really hard, just because I'm a Cali, Cali girl, and um, I, that was my first winter. And of course, the first winter that um, in New York was the hardest winter so far. <laughs> so I had to put hand warmers all over me, but that's the hardest so far. It was fun though. The time I got to feel my body numb, but like, you don't really feel that your body's numb. So at Donut Lover eleven twenty four from Instagram asked, "What was your first World of Dance event, and how did you feel nervous or excited?" I think I think my first World of Dance event was in Hawaii, twenty four seven Dance Force. Love you guys, miss you. It was like a Red Riding Hood wolf thing thing, and um, it was, that was the concept. And I was, I, don't, I think I was more excited than nervous, but the, 
the one thing was I had to, I had, it was when my head was shaved and out for me because I could not do the hair, my hair for the life of me. And so she did my hair and then she said, okay, I don't have time to bobby pin it. So you have to remember to bobby pin it down before you go on stage. And I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot to bobby pin my hair. So the whole time my head is like, my hair is like flopping around. Oh man. And then I accidentally tripped Summer. I felt bad about that, but what can you do? ES Sam the Game Master from Instagram asked, have you ever been bullied by other kids? Yes, I have been bullied by other kids. When I was in elementary school, I was pretty much the only kid who had to wear glasses, so I was called four eyes and stuff like that. And I wasn't, I, I was always into dance, so I wasn't really into sports, but I, wa I wanted to hang out with other kids and the only thing that they were doing was like playing basketball and stuff like that so I would tr I, I don't know what I was thinking but I would try to play the sport with them and I didn't even have any clue play the sport so they would get mad at me and whatever but um yeah one time a girl threw a dodgeball at me hit me in the face I fell on my back in the, in the field uh I mean it wasn't funny then but it's funny now uh, so yeah, I don't like people who bully. I think mean people suck and I don't think anybody should put up with anything like that. I think scientifically it takes more energy to frown than to smile. So I think it takes more energy to be mean than to just be nice. So if someone's being mean to me, I just shoo, shoo fly, don't bother me. Um, yeah. So I say just stick up for yourself. That's what I have to say about mean people. At PP Perdona from Twitter asked, what is your favorite candy? My favorite candy, um, just like, um, I can't think of the name. <laughs> um, <laughs> the, the sour straw things, the watermelon flavor. Okay, well, I don't know what they're called, but uh, they're like sour straw things with like, I think it's airheads or something like that, something similar. So, because I can't remember, I'm going to go with Hershey's chocolate bars because when I do s'mores, I like to slit the marshmallow in the middle and put the Hershey bar, Hershey piece in the marshmallow. And that way, when you roast the marshmallow, it's like all gooey on the inside. It's really good. At E S Y R D A L E from Twitter asked, What is one thing you love about playing Catwoman in Gotham? I mean, I love everything about playing Cat, uh, Selena Kyle on Gotham, but I would say my costume. I really love my costume. I mean, I've had to go, I've had to go through three pairs of pants because I've ripped pretty much all of them. But it's really cool. I like all the layers that I have, and I feel like I'm going into battle. So it's really, it's really cool. At Y U M O C A K from Instagram asked if there was a zombie apocalypse who would be on your zombie apocalypse team? My dad, my mom because she's resourceful. I think my friend Rebecca would want to come, but I wouldn't want her to come because I don't think she would be able to survive and I don't want to lose her. So I'm gonna have her stay in the shelter. And so in that case, I have, oh, uh, okay, so I have myself, my mom, my dad, my cats. Yeah, so just my family. Cause I think we're pretty cool people. So those are all the questions for this month's hashtag, hashtag Ask Cameron. Uh, thank you so much for participating and asking questions. Um, so keep watching and keep asking. I appreciate it.